Today, you're gonna learn why Ian just hates to work with honey. Stay and you safe. should too. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Welcome to Combat Cocktails. I'm Derek. That's Ian. We're making a cocktail for you guys. This is going to be called the Cranberry Sauce Margarita. It's kind of, I, I was I was on the fence. It's the Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving take on is it? Is it, should we just do it for the fall season? Because cranberries are good. Like, I don't know. So we're doing it. Yeah, so whatever. This is this is happening right now. So the recipe's going to be, pop so it up now. It. It's all good. We'll see if it all just sticks to the plunger or it comes out. He's working with honey. I have pessimistic <laughs> aspirations to the honey working. I got this via Delish. <laughs> it's a website, Delish. Two ounces of tequila, one ounce of fresh lime juice, one and a half tablespoons of chunky cranberry sauce, one teaspoon of honey, and a brown sugar rimming. I gotta love a brown sugar rimming. You just like any kind of honey. Yeah, obviously. Yeah, that's always a good time. So. Um, what I'm gonna do is because I don't have I don't have my lime I've already squeezed pre squeezed lime so I'm just gonna squeeze lime in a paper towel. so I'm gonna lime the paper towel you could use a sponge I wouldn't use one you used to clean sponges oh, that would be dirty bad. dirty sponges dirty sponge <laughs> you use your dirty bacteria. sponge you want to use your bacteria ridden dirty sponges when you do this and then you know just touch it up it. brown sugar doesn't work very good see how it's all stuck there anyway no see it's coming out. Perfectly fine. Uh, brown sugar doesn't stick very good, See? so <laughs> that's the thing. Um, oh, good. I don't really think that's gonna work as well oh, as I was hoping. That. It's gonna be stuck to the side now. So it can't be hot. So here's my ghetto brown sugar. That's unfortunate. I don't really know a better way of getting sticking brown sugar on there if it doesn't stick there naturally. Hey, Whatever. Buddy. Can I have that lime juice? No. Well, then you want to finish the drink yourself, dear? There. Okay. I don't know what this is going to do with this chunky cranberry juice or cranberry sauce. I think it's kind of funny. What should I do? <laughs> oh my god, you don't even know what's going on. By the way, our executive producer for uh, two weeks ago, or a week ago, should have been Cameron Smith. I forgot it. Patreon.com slash CMC. Also, the executive producer that follows after... So, so this is where Cameron Smith is. After that, you're going to see the executive producer that is actually for this episode... Uh, his name's Frank. Uh, I'm going to say Cartier. Uh, Low-carb cocktail guy. He's usually in the live stream. I don't know if he's in there right now. He might have been. This would not be his month. <laughs> no low-carb cocktails coming. Hey, Frank, you waiting for the wrong guy. Uh, he has a YouTube channel. You can search it up. It's uh, He goes by the name of Low-Carb Cocktails. Google that. If you're into low... We're not we're big low carb cocktail guys. All that's over, honey. Yeah, it's all over the glass. <laughs> that's crazy. He doesn't like honey. Uh, that's why I use honey syrup. Honey syrup. Is There's a link above for honey syrup. Oh, I should have looked earlier. <laughs> you should have. Um, could have made honey syrup. Could have. So, <laughs> yeah, uh, low carb cocktail guy makes low carb cocktails out of stuff that's. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Comment cocktails. <laughs> That kid, that's always what you can say whenever something's going weird. You're like, that's not the, right. It's common man. Shut up. I got, we've got <laughs> piles. Oh, we didn't do crushed ice. I didn't bother with the cranberry garnishes. And you want to keep it chill. My brown that's sugar right. is like, it looks like it might have been sand stuck in on your ass when you went to the beach. Like, I think the message here is you don't have to have it look right to taste right. Right. There you go. Unless, unless. Way to say it, Ian. Way to yeah. say it. You can keep going on and on about how much it sucks, but that's the, <laughs> that's the message. I think we've delivered that. This isn't as chunky as I, I was worried about. All oh, the chunks are still in there. Oh, that's good. Yeah. You want some chunks? Mm -mm. I'll give you some chunks. I got chunks. Mm, try that. Oh, there's chunkies in there. I can see them. Yeah, they flow out the bottom. The you seeds. should see the chunks in the glass. In yeah, the those chicken. are just the seeds. I guess you could use this for making actual... Mm. Uh, I like the color. It looks it's like a bad. Cadillac margarita. It's kind of good. Actually. Probably be nicer if it was a little sweeter, but, you know, well, the honey doesn't thing. mix. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I thought you were going to say honey didn't stick to it. The lesson yeah. here is honey mix. Oh, wow, there's a lot of cranberry in there. Yeah, I think we, we shook out all the cranberry gel and left the cranberry chunks. chunks. You're just going to get the chunk. And there goes the seeds. It's the seeds. You want some more? Seeds? I'll get you some seeds. Uh, it's a little tart, but at the same That's time, good, you're, you, you, I get, agreed, there's some honey that didn't dis dilute because we didn't use warm water. We didn't create a honey syrup. 
Um, oh, I think that's okay. I think it's still good. But you're also using cranberries. We're just making it that much more low carb. This is true. <laughs> low carb cocktail guy would like this drink, I think. It's besides the fact that there's sugar and carbs in here. Um, but the cranberry sauce is going to tarten it up. Yeah. There is sugar. Here's there's one sugar of, in the cranberry sauce. There is. And I bought, so I bought Taste of Inspirations, which is our local brand from the grocery store at Hannaford. Um, this I bought because it says, here's the ingredients. You just go, your mind is about to just be blown. Okay, Ready? It's cranberries. Cranberries. Sugar. Cane sugar. Water. water. What's the last ingredient? Uh, gelatin. Pectin, yeah. Pectin. So that's it. Like when you look at like the can. Nailed it. Nailed it. You know the, you, but you know the can stuff? Nailed it. It's like all high fructose corn syrup and stuff. Yeah. Like there's. And, and it was it was like 50 cents more for actually having sugar in it. I was like, well, I might as well just get the one that sounds like it's a better product. Yeah. Screw that. We Good buy product. Coke. I buy imported Coke. I don't, I don't need high fructose corn syrup in my diet. I have enough other bad and things in my and diet. Mexico. Isn't all Coke imported? Uh. <laughs> oh, yeah, I get it. You're talking about the white <laughs> stuff. <laughs> Tastes like cranberries. Kind of like a Cadillac margarita. Hmm. Um, At least in looks. And taste a little bit. A little bit, yeah, because that's not too sweet either, right? Yeah. Right. And, it's but, lemonade in that, isn't it? Uh, cranberry juice, I think. Yeah. Yeah, that's just straight up cranberry juice. But, I, but this has more agave flavor. It's probably because we use a reposado. It's got a like, yeah. nice, bright... But there's a, there's a good amount of tequila against those other ingredients. Um, especially with the sugar, a teaspoon versus an ounce, which you would typically use on a lot of cocktails, or, or a half ounce, or something sure. like that. Yeah, yeah. Um, so it's got to be Two naturally less, plus it sticks to the side of your shaker with all the other... This is a bitch to clean up. Yep. Uh, speaking, but we're doing it for you. Right. So, But if if you like these, these this like tin shaker and stuff, you can go to AustinDrakes.com. Save yourself 17% off by using Halloween 17. <laughs> Buy two. Get one for yourself or... Uh yourself and uh, well, wasn't stocking sure stuff off for Christmas. Yeah, you could totally put a whole shaker kid inside of a stocking. Um, just get a big stocking. Yeah. Or put a little note in there that says your stocking stuffer is under the stocking. You know, yeah. look down and go, oh, there it is. Yeah. See what your stocking is sitting on? Yeah. Put your stocking stuffer that's unstuffed. Right. <laughs> unstuffed stocking stuffer is only yeah. available. Too stuffy in here. And stocking also stuffer. And if you like, if you like the CMC bar mats or the other stuff or if you're like uh, maybe the holidays are coming up. Maybe you need something for Thanksgiving, for cocktails. You can get some stuff there. You can tell your significant other. Oh, if you just go to austrace.com slash CMC, you can get all the gear that has the CMC logo on it. That'd be cool. And there's years of history in the video channel of holiday-themed cocktails and whatnot that you yes. can use this new, newly acquired gear to make. Oldie yeah. acquired cocktails. Well, yeah. Like the Cadillac Margarita. Yeah. And all those Oldie things. but a goodie. Oldie but a goodie. I'm, I feel like I'm on 2020 now. I'm just repeating everything you're saying. It's okay. <laughs> it's just because it's smart. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget, you should click the like button on this. If you haven't subscribed already, you want to do so. That's it, my friend. Sidebar for two videos. I'm going to probably throw some Halloween or at least some fall themed stuff in the sidebars and in the main page. Um, also below the link to Austin Drake so you can go buy stuff. That's a thing. We're teaching you how to drink.